Breaking news, folks. XRP could be getting delisted from Coinbase. We're going to take a look at the article that just came out, by the way. Uh, so as you can see, we are currently on the article here, Coinbase to suspend, suspend XRP trading following SEC lawsuit. So very interesting stuff. We're going to go ahead and just get started, take a look at the charts, see how they might be reacting to this, how the markets might be reacting. And uh, let's go ahead and get started. All right, folks, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. We're bringing you the latest crypto Bitcoin information on the hot topics today. XRP could be seeing a delisting from Coinbase. This has been in the talks as of right now, but uh, we are currently uh, trying to figure out what's going on here with the delisting. So as you can see, uh, we have this article here and we'll, we'll kind of read over it for the most part. It says Coinbase said it will suspend trading of XRP, the cryptocurrency US Securities and Exchange Commission sued last week claiming it is really a security. Interesting, Coinbase first listed XRP and its retail facing platforms in February 2019. Starting now, XRP trading will move into limit only coinbase wrote it will be fully suspended on tuesday january 19th at 1 p.m so we still have a little while folks uh obviously you know if you are a long-term holder of this coin um that is on your own prerogative hey i'm just some guy on youtube so don't take anything that i say as financial advice but uh i can state that you know i think i'm probably still going to be hanging on here maybe buying the dip too as well but let's read on into the article we will continue to monitor legal developments related to xrp and update our consumers our customers as more information becomes available uh paul gruller of coinbase's chief legal officer wrote in a blog post shared uh in advance with coinbase or coindesk coinbase said users xrp wallets will remain available to receive and withdraw functionality after the trading is suspended so your assets will be okay if you are leaving them on coinbase um Obviously, you might want to consider moving them into a uh, cold storage wallet or some type of other wallet where you have custodial over it. Um, but let's see. Notably, the exchange said it will support an upcoming airdrop of Spark tokens to XRP holders. XRP will still support will still be supported by Coinbase uh, custody in the self custodial Coinbase wallet. Uh, so yeah, Coinbase does have a wallet that you uh, can also um, keep, make sure that you hold the private keys, which is the Coinbase wallet. Um, so I guess it's still supporting the Spark airdrop. I'm not 100% sure. I did release a video a while back uh, related to the Spark airdrop, and we used the Exodus wallet on ours. So <clears throat> the snapshot was taken, uh, I believe, last month in December. Coinbase declined the comment beyond its written statement. The price of XRP on Coinbase taken from 28 to 20 cent, or 28 cents to 24 cents within 20 minutes of the announcement since the announcement of SEC's lawsuit last week. The price of XRP has fallen more than 50%. Wow, so we have obviously, quote unquote, the ripple effect happening with XRP as of right now, which is pretty, pretty insane, folks. Uh, from Coinbase, the reason for dropping XRP as a traded asset was simple. As the company seeks to go public, being platformed is something that potentially is security would mean adding more paperwork simply so it could be legally allowed to let retail customers buy and sell a single cryptocurrency. The SEC claimed last week that XRP is a security and that Ripple has been selling it without registering or seeking an uh, exemption from seven years raising 1.3 billion dollars in the process the legal battle itself is just beginning and litigation make take years if ripple fights to change in court in an in, uh, indication would okay so obviously there's this is going to be panning out for a while we've been taking a look at the charts here and there for the most part and uh, we'll go ahead and jump over into the charts without further ado um, and it looks like this article is pretty much over coinbase is the biggest exchange xrp would serve uh, beneath platforms on friday bitstamp announced so also bitstamp did uh suspend uh xrp trading as well and so xrp suspension earlier monday affected january exchanges that continue to list xrp without registering it as a security exchange with the sec face potential consequences down the line including possible enforcement okay so you know the i guess they're gonna go after ripple man uh, it does it just looks like they're gonna you know continue to drill on xrp um i'm not getting scared folks this is i definitely think just kind of a um, you know, FUD throwing in the space right now. And uh, I'm taking a look at Bitcoin and we're going to take a look at the charts, move on over to the charts. Let's transition over there. Let's move on over. All right. So taking a look at Bitcoin, we're looking here at Bitcoin on the 20 minute time frame. Uh, let's zoom in here. You can see that we are sitting at about 26,700 or so. And also we are taking a look at the 
20 minute chart we can see here that we did get a blood diamond on bitcoin as of right now so maybe these uh markets are considering tanking as of right now let's take a look at the 15 minute time frame 15 minute yeah shows a little bit of a sell pressure momentum waves also moving to the downside folks we use the market cipher indicator by crypto face on this channel uh if you're interested in picking up some of our paid for indicators that we use such as market cipher the ti sequential by tone vase and the market guide buy and sell signal there's links in the description box below um so let's see we also are going to be taking a look at some of our mid time frames maybe the two hour just to see how things are going right now it does look like momentum's kind of trailing off to the side but i think we're forming up some type of symmetrical triangle here on bitcoin and without further ado let's move on over into xrp see what's going on over here um zoom out on our candles here boom all right xrp baby where you at <laughs> let's see what's going on over here man um man all right so xrp currently trying to hold support at the 22 cent area um this has been major major support for us if we zoom out here on our daily charts um uh, let's take a look and see what's going on in, on the daily so boom hitting the daily chart and we, you know this was our last consolidation area was about at 22 cents or so uh you can see here that you know we're starting to definitely kind of um have a waterfall trickle effect to the downside uh, with XRP. And our next area of support would probably be down here at about maybe 16 cents or so. That was our last consolidation phase that we kind of had with XRP was right around 16 cents. So it does look like we are probably going to be making a move closer to that downside and our last consolidation area or so, um, you know, here in the near term future, if these delistings continue to occur, these, man, it just looks horrible as of right now. You can see the yellow X, which is our whale signal uh, that there is manipulation obviously going on in this market, but also big dumps just occurring. And uh, it doesn't look like it's going to slow down here, especially on a 12 hour time frame when we see one of these yellow X's. Uh, we need to kind of be fearful a little bit. Um, but also at the same time, you know, when blood is in the streets, we are going to be greedy and vice versa. Uh, quoting Warren Buffett, one of the greatest financial investors, too. Uh, so, you know, I think that. If anything, we're going to definitely um, probably be waiting for this 13 cent uh, retest on XRP uh, or probably about 16 cents, obviously, 16 cents down here with our last consolidation phase. Uh, definitely looking like we could retrace all the way back down into that area, folks. So definitely just keep an eye on XRP. Let's zoom out here into these higher time frames and just see how long this could last. Because uh, if we zoom out here on our three day chart, we're definitely looking at momentum waves that are continuing to moving down. Uh, money flow is just thin here. So I have no doubt that this uh, momentum wave will continue on down here to the bottom side and probably give us a uh, big green dot down here too as well. So we're definitely going to be keeping a close eye on probably some of our mid time frames and our higher time frames to wait for this, uh, you know, XRP price action to recover. But man, this, this doesn't look good. It looks like we're probably going to be end up breaking through this 22 cent area and uh, making our way down to, into that 16 cent area or so. So I did want to get this video out to you um, and let you know what's going on with XRP, where some of our price targets are to the downside. Um, but, you know, obviously, if you're a long term holder, then um, you may be scooping this up on the dip. So <laughs> shout out to you. I think once everything gets settled, you know, we've seen kick th go through this. We've seen Veritasium go through this. Um, so it's nothing new to the space. Right. Um, they're going to probably end up having to pay a fee. And more than likely, that fee is getting paid off right now. Obviously, probably some of the company of Ripple and XRP are selling their assets to um, be able to pay the SEC too as well. So likely that is to occur. That's the same thing that happened with uh, the the Kin token. Um, with uh, you know when that was being. Um, you know, SEC was going after them and then Veritasium, um, same thing happened. So, you know, it is what it is. And then these, these prices are going to recover. So obviously just make sure you're doing your due diligence. Um, obviously I'm not a financial advisor. If you need to seek financial advice, then, um, definitely find someone that is reliable for that. Uh, but folks, don't forget, we have a Patreon page. If you're interested in some of our other alts that we are in accumulation of as of right now, you can definitely join us over on the Patreon page right now. I am running a 16% off special for the whole year. Year. So if you'd like to join us for the whole year, you get 16% off. And uh, yeah, folks, this is our Ripple XRP news for today. I'll see you all in the next one. Until then, CTO signing out. Peace.